to kick things off for Hacker Replay 61, we are going to start on Villa, where we have Eden Fran accusing 06.mo. I see a Cav ban from this team, which makes me feel like this must be low elo. He did look over at the window, but nothing really occurred there. Oh, there's someone on the left corner that he doesn't know about. And he missed his shots on Capcan. I just love Dex, bro. Okay, he would have seen mute there. He is whiffing hard. Thanks for the gifted sub double deuces. He has grenades too. If he was like easily cheating and knew where mute was, then say you could just bounce a grenade off of this. I just love Dex, bro. This is the right person, I think. Making sure. Uh, thank you for the two months ETF death. I just love Dex. And also sub from Centering. But geez, you guys are going crazy with the subs right now. I take one day off and everyone's like, got a sub today. Who knows when Varsity will be back. The, the accuser isn't watching Yana yet, so I'm wondering if this is going to have something come in later. Okay. The fact that they keep looking at places where no one is, and no one has been, makes me feel like they're probably going to be legit. And then when we factor in the cav ban, it makes me think even... Oh. He, he just saw the bandit. Oh no. But when you factor in stuff like the cab, it makes me think even more that this must be a... A low rank player accusing a high rank smurf, probably. Thanks for some chaos, man. I don't even have to sell out anymore. I remember the days when I used to have to be like, hey guys... If you really want to support the channel and help me out, like it would mean so much to me if you could sub, blah 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 blah. Now, I don't even have to say anything. People just do it. This is the ultimate sell out goal. Mark, got the C4. You should do duo to diamond with Roy. Roy the other day asked me if I wanted to play. I said yes. And he stopped talk, uh, messaging me. I don't think even if I wanted to, I could get Roy to agree to play with me. The man is the master of leaving people on red. He's being spotted by the volcano that's right next to him. He just saw it in the lamp. Watching your echo so useful video. I was uh I was a little afraid people were gonna go crazy about how I was facing like bronze players, but people didn't really seem to care that much, which is nice. Okay, he did pre-fire while like uh, lining that person up through the wall, but not really that suspicious given that nothing else has happened. Person's gun. He's looking at 90 because that's where the person was last seen. He's not even looking at the left of the door, and then the Lucy walks right into his shot. I 
I, I like we do have to watch a lot of it at least most of it because obviously this person could start toggling like let's say they're down three to one could start toggling and just going blatant so we'll have to watch at least to overtime but i am having a hard time imagining that this person's doing anything suspicious given that there have been so many times where they do something like that where someone's like right next to them and they have no idea and the person just gets away I don't know why. Or how they got accused. When's my next pack opening? I do a pack opening at the beginning of every season. Watch it actually like go down three to one and then he just starts hacking off his tits. I keep seeing all the Twitter posts and like uh, Reddit posts of people cheating and they're just walking around just auto firing Cali Sniper non stop. Okay, you would have been able to hear the pulse scanner get put away. They actually almost choked that because they looked away the millisecond they were, saw Pulse's hand, and the timing almost got them killed. Seems like a good player in a lower lobby. It does seem like that. Oh, they died. Although, I will say, we say good player in a low lobby, but, uh, doesn't seem that great. Because they are now 3-2. and two. That being said, you know, I am very clearly a Diamond 1 player, and the other day, in bronze, I was struggling to go positive, so. As a fellow amazing player, it, it can be difficult to actually do well against bronze or copper players. Thanks for the four months nave. I looked at one of my replays the other day and it looked like I had walls, did three very sketchy looking things in a row. Yeah, that's why, like, for me, in order to call someone a cheater, I usually have to see them do sketchy things in different rounds across the match. Because it's like, if it all happened at once or like... You know, there's only like one or two instances of it. You can't really say like, oh, for sure they're cheating. You got to find like multiple repetitive actions. Which is why the other day I posted the clip and the video of uh, the one person on Outback who got, what was it, like four or five? Or no, four instances of suspicious behavior. There was like the time they lined up the cab behind them, the time they lined up the rook through the wall, lined up someone else through the wall twice in a row. It was like... You know, four instances is a little hard to explain. One, you can explain it. Okay, try hacks for a vid on another account. No. I would never do something that stupid. Because one, if I do that, I'm just giving money to the hack creators. And therefore supporting them. Number two, if I do that, I'd probably get banned, I would assume. Alright, the only way they can win this round and stop themselves from going down one to three is uh, if this person aces. Diffuser is not down. And they whiffed all of their shots. Oh my god, okay. So now they're going to be down one to three. They are full turtling on site. Hello Honda, is that a reference to my first copper to diamond where I made my name Big Ronda and for some reason people kept calling me Big R Honda? Never forget. Maybe for overtime rounds, we'll just like kind of skip forward to when they get kills and see if there's anything suspicious around there. Because honestly, like unless they just start fucking sliding around and insta killing people, I I don't think that they're gonna be cheating at all. Especially with shots missed like that. Also, keep in mind that the kill he got on Sledge was the Sledge was trying to 
hammer the downed uh, Aruni. Which now means he's at a triple kill. Quad. You couldn't ace last round, but maybe this round. Teammates are on cameras. I don't hear any pings, but they could be given calls. I guess we're about to find out what cameras. Nope, never mind. And he whiffs. No ace. But they win because it goes to round six. So you got three people coming from study, two people above him, and he's just looking at Memorial. More. More evidence that he is innocent, but we'll still wait. Wait and see. That was a pretty nice shot. I'm assuming they just went like hella off with kills and then got accused of cheating because of it. If they drop like a 20 bomb, people will be like, you must be cheating. There's no way you dropped 20 kills. Meanwhile, I dropped 20 kills like every other match, so I, don't, I must be getting reported all the time. I would be curious to see if one day I would ever, or I, it might have already happened, I just never saw it because I don't look at every single submission, but imagine where I get a submission where someone's accusing me on one of my alt accounts or streamer mode name accounts. Uh, one thing I'll add is that when the Valkyrie was on cameras looking at the Osa, it almost looked like they were looking at them through the closet wall and just kind of watching them through it. Gave me a little inkling of uh, suspicion. Oh my god, that aim. Maybe they're not a smurf, maybe they're... Maybe they're just as bad as everyone else. Ugh, that did not... That did not look good. Chat while we uh, wait for this match to go through. Me and Annie booked our hotels for our Europe trip. Or one of them. Excited. I don't want to give too, too much information about where we're going or when we're going because i don't trust you fuckers someone's gonna be like oh varsity mentioned that his the plane that he'll be flying on has a tray table but comes out at a 90 degree angle as opposed to a 100 degree angle which means that he must be flying on this uh airplane which only operates out of this airline which only comes from this airport to this airport therefore varsity's on this flight calling a bomb threat someone in chat or someone in my community is gonna be that crazy that was a little bit suspicious. You would be able to hear Capitel Vault in here. We know that. It's not mm, crazy suspicious, I guess, that he knows he vaulted in. But, well, it look, I guess it looked a little bit suspicious because it almost looked like they lined him up through the wall, but they would have just been holding an angle from the door, so... They also just completely missed the person right next to them in statue. They would have had an angle. You should trust us more? God, no. Chad is the last uh, entity I'll ever trust. Okay. Do they get back up? Nope. Okay. Round over. He looked below at the beginning. He was looking at his uh, teammate pulse. There is one more round after this, so... They very clearly win. I'm torn. Like, their aim actually seems somewhat decent. Like, the vertical recoil seems good, but I feel like the horizontal, they keep going side to side. And then their movement has also just been very robotic for the most part. 
They don't seem that good, but yet they have 13 kills. Jerf's a lot of fun. Well, we. Oh my god, that was almost horrible. While we appreciate recommendations and stuff, uh, we should be fine because basically my brother planned a whole trip for his family and then that fell through because uh, they weren't going to Europe anymore and then he basically just gave us his itinerary. It's like, sweet. We're going to do basically your vacation. And for me, it'll be probably a lot of just exploring because I've never been to Europe, so... Obviously, we'll be in Berlin for a few days because we're going there for the R6 Major, but then before that, we're traveling. Also, I will add that this, uh, this player does seem like someone who... I guess watches a lot of like tips and tricks videos so they know what to do they know the game mechanics and how to play they just don't have exactly the skill required to do that because like this is a very common pro league spot but now i'm wondering how did they uh how did they know someone was there they go on cameras, they don't have anything. They go on this camera, and the person... I guess maybe the Finca called it up, and they go behind bar, behind bar. But then it almost looks like they follow them, but then they completely whiff the shots there. So, oh. It, it does feel a lot like someone who watches tips and tricks videos, but doesn't actually have the skills or mechanics to necessarily play on the same level as the people who make those videos. And that's like the third time now. It's a pretty... Actually, wait one sec. Let me check. I want to see, was the mutant an active gunfight with the Nomad? To the point where like Nomad could give the call that they're in vault. They did get shot at from Vault. Nomad was 100% not giving calls that they're in Vault, but if you're smart, you could be like, okay, here are shots, they're probably in Vault. Again, there are some small things that I find weird, but at least compared to other people that we've seen who are like closet cheating, it's nowhere even close to as obvious as them. So if they are in the end cheating, they're doing a really, really good job of hiding it. Nice. Orcs is holding basically what Valkyrie held before on that one window. Laundry room is being broken into and Valk's on camera is not noticing. Marks holds him off. Dog's still on cameras. Marks better. About to run into Yana in library. Nope. Does not hear the shot right behind them. Are they deaf? <laughs> what? Even with the shitty match replay audio, I could hear that. Doesn't hear that? What? I just love Dex, bro. Apparently this Valkyrie is suddenly deaf because they can't hear anything on the Yana behind them. They're just completely lost. I don't know where they're looking. Honestly, I don't think they're cheating. I don't think it's possible that they're cheating, because they are just constantly lost. Unless they're just doing a really, really good job of hiding it. To the point where it's basically a detriment to them. Drops 18 kills. I'm assuming got reported for how many kills they dropped. Uh, they said accused final KD 18 to 5. 
or 18 kills, 5 deaths. So they accuse them because of their KD. They have a casual KD of 6. I'm going to guess before we even look at it that it's probably one match or maybe two matches uh, this season. They have 5 abandons in casual. They have 5 abandons. They killed 6 people, died once, and then just never played casual again. The person who reported them is normally gold. So, I don't know. I guess just because they, they did well. Not a cheater. First match, done. In this one, we have... I'm going to assume it's Dizzy1. They didn't include their name, but the file said Dizzy Hush. So, Dizzy1, who is accusing... Am I blind? They submitted the wrong match. Okay, it's the cafe one. Sorry. Where we have SoFlo, who is accusing number 28. The round is half done, and they only just spawned. There's no way this is like a blatantly obvious cheater that goes to nine rounds, right? Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Very slow this round. Um, compared to the normal round, or the previous round, they, uh, they haven't even left spawn yet. And the first round would have been almost over. Very, very different approach. I don't know how that even could make sense. Because replays don't tell you how long the match is in time. I'm trying to shot, shoot a, a lamp right there. thought it was a camera, I guess. Happens to the best of us. Tried to flick over. Just, uh, just out of curiosity. Why'd they flick over shoot? They couldn't even see them. Oh no, they could. They could. They saw them through the name. I also just want to quickly see it. Could just be me. This did not look like a kill on the thorn, I think it was. It was a headshot, but I don't know how it was. That was not a headshot. Being this AFK does concern me a little bit just because I'm sure many of you who play PC know that a lot of the time when someone decides to toggle on their cheats, they tab out and they are AFK. <clears throat> for like a minute. So I'm hoping that the Ash is not doing that. God, his aim is so horrible. He did just keep aiming at the... Who was that? Kaid? I know they died, but it did look like they were trying to stare at the Valkyrie through the wall and hit them with an ash charge there. That seemed weird. And now they're going to be down 0 to 3. Are they going to start toggling like crazy? They're an Ash Jaeger main, by the way. This is, this is iconic Ash Jaeger mains. I'm losing. Time to cheat. Still doing this weird, like, half AFK thing at the beginning of the round, which, again, is very emblematic of normally toggling on cheats. Because they have to usually tab out and, like, activate some shit in order to get it to work. Uh, do you only need the match ID for a replay? You have to send me the actual file. Sending me a match ID doesn't do anything. Been in a match with a stupid cheater, said that you won't choose old matches. Um, well, I usually just go through and find the first six that catch my eye. Um, can't really, you know, choose 50 matches a week because that would be a little much. Uh, on top of that, uh, I do not choose matches that have like five rounds or less. I only choose six or more because I want to look at 
ranked or unranked cheaters, not casual cheaters. This guy's still acting weird. I don't like this. Uh, he's, his animations are starting to bug out a little bit. Team killed with a grenade. Uh oh. I th think he started cheating because he did not hit them. Uh, I think he has aim assist now. Must be a controller player. <laughs> Even ping the wall because he knows where they are. He has to deny the ace to get the clutch, which we know he's going to do. I think he started cheating. I'm telling you, if you're an Ash Jaeger main, it means you're a cheater. Or it means you have the Varsity Gaming Charm, which basically just gives you wall hacks in game. It makes you that good. And you can get it for free by subbing to my Twitch channel with Twitch Prime or use $5. Damn it, he turned on, or he went off of a or Jaeger. That's fine. He's still a cheater. He still went Ash for three rounds, Jaeger for one round. Yeah, I think he has aim assist. Oh, he already killed someone. That was not a headshot. Uh, guess it could be ping. That did not look like a headshot to me. That was not a headshot for sure. Not even close to a headshot. Pretty sure his aim just flicked to that person through the wall there. If we watch that in slow mo. Aiming at him, but hip fire aim through the wall. He just tried to wall bang them. His shots aren't even close. He's hitting him here. Bruh, okay, this guy's cheating. Shamelessly cheating now. Like his movement and his aim is definitely not good enough to be getting these kills that he is getting. He's standing right in front of an open hole and he has no idea. He's just aiming at nothing. Unfortunate for Orange Team because it looks like they were actually just the much better players, but this guy had to start cheating in order to win his rank game. Let me guess, if we got around 9, he's probably gonna have like 20 kills. 14. Oh, his team started team killing him. His three of his teammates killed him. I'm surprised that Halen hasn't. Although maybe at the beginning of the round he does. No. Oh, they're just. I guess they're gonna try to rush plant. 
That way the team can defuse it. Or are they just playing it out normally? I can't tell. I don't know why. One thing I always hate is when uh, teams will team kill the cheater, but then still try to play the game. Like, just either team kill them and throw the match, or just let them play. Like, what's the point? Yeah, this guy's completely... Wait, does he not have walls? All he has is aim assist? He was just shooting at nothing. She normally should be at nothing anyways and getting kills, but still. Uh, I'm going to assume number 28 is a streamer mode name. So the one match he did not have R6 Tracker open for is the match that that person was in. I wonder if he's queued with him. He is. <laughs> we found him. Sick Molly. 2.67 KD. Queued with Bloomed and uh, CR Cax, and I guess stole this account. Well, not banned yet. We know that. Otherwise, they'd have a banned thing here. All right, in this match, we have SpongeBob hyphen BB, who is accusing Love I girl. Love. Did they submit the wrong match? Bro, what is with people today? All right, we're gonna have to pull up an extra match after. That's two matches now where people submit the wrong match. Okay, moving on to, what is this, the third match? Yeah, because we have had four matches, two submitted wrong. We have the barcode, who is accusing YNCJ, their own teammate. Another overtime match, god damn it. All the non-overtime matches were the wrong submissions. Also, uh, just point us out, he is also a Jaeger, so if he is also cheating, then we have absolute proof that all Ash Jaeger mains are cheaters, as he cheats. Heard it here first, folks. If you play Ash and Jaeger, or Jaeger, you are a cheater. And then he almost lost that gunfight. You have cheats and you almost lost? Can't even hit a drone? That's insane. Yikes. Might make a good thumbnail. And get him hip firing, drop shotting. Do not notice him one hitting barricades? That's the spectator bug. With match replay. I bet if we restart the round and go to where he hit it, it did not one hit. Because uh, if you rewind and then fast forward, it bugs out hard. So I hate this fucking ambient noise. You could just be getting calls through. Okay, just a uh, drop shot, hip fire, you'll hit him right here, 100%. Alright, teammate. Yeah, see? Wasn't even broken. Alright, well, YNCJ. Actually, what did, they, what did they end the match at? I assume the cheating team won, because there's no way you can team kill them that much. Um, I'm also just going to throw out the fact that Barcode, the person who submitted the match and said they're cheating, did not team kill. Unless they forgave him, which wouldn't make any sense. The cheater would not want to forgive it because then you can team kill again with no punishment. But I am shocked that they are somehow only 12 and 6. Wonder who's with them. 
they also seem to have the aim assist uh, cheats because they completely missed Warden but still got the kill. Just runs right past the pulse. They lost that gunfight? Hold on, who wins this? The sledge killed himself. Was that intentional? Oh no. How can a team with a hacker have everything go so wrong so quickly? That is insane. Another teammate dead. Oh, this guy's also cheating. That's how. Okay. So they're queued together and they're cheating together. Because that guy just tried to pre-fire him through the wall. He has straight up walls. Okay. So now it's a 1v3 for the cheater. Bro, if the cheating team loses this, this is... Gonna be... Unbelievable. Of course a Finca main would be cheating too. They almost lost that gunfight? Oh my god. Now they're trying to pretend... Actually, why aren't they just walling off their tits? They know they're cheating. I guess maybe they're still trying to pretend a little bit that they're not. I'm invested in this. I want to see who wins. They let the cheater win now. Oh, thank God. Alright. Cheater lost. That's insane. But they work definitely cute together. Cheater is not banned. Oh, there they are. Wait, was this person actually not cheating? I guess we can see if they were actually queued together in that match. I think it was this one, right? Oh no, they were queued together. Okay, never mind, they are cheating. You think they ran out? Oh, they did run out. No, oh, you're right. At the end of the day, though, they were still queued with the cheater, so cheating. Hopefully, this is the right submission. It is. We have Larry Miller, 1964. I don't know who Larry Miller is, um, but they are accusing Jake Harper. Uh. Please, no teleportation hacks. still droning out but his first shots that he took on that car while only like two feet away did have absolutely zero recoil and I could be mistaken there but did it not look like this F2 had absolutely zero recoil I know I don't have the best recoil control so I'm not the one to claim too much but like it almost looked like the recoil was non-existent and it's just their aim that was bad We'll be able to see in future rounds.
doesn't really look like much recoil there either. These guys are gonna rush every single round, it looks like. Because the round is already half done. Again, almost no recoil. Sucks. Oh. Again, round is already almost over, and they only just spawned in. The C8 recoil is pretty bad too, and right there, even though it was a short burst and it was only a few feet away, it looked like it had zero recoil. They're always rushing. And I'm pretty sure this is ranked as well. It's not even going to be like, oh, you know, it's unranked, who cares? I swear it looked like he just lined up all those people through the wall. And right there, zero recoil. There was a tiny bit of vertical, but that did not seem like he was even pulling down. It looked like it was just flat. Just he just pre-fired the head? Nice. What? I guess he, he might have been able to see the Jaeger there, but... Uh, I don't think so. Why is that mirror already... Shot out though. Maybe. Maybe it was the twitch. He actually flicked to them through the wall and almost hit them. It's hard to tell because it's so choppy and so buggy. But again, there it looked like zero recoil. Shot a random shot through the wall. Did he hit the mirror? I'm pretty sure the mirror was destroyed by the Twitch drone. Because he shot the Jaeger through it. So it must be destroyed. Now he's just chilling. They lose the next two rounds and then win. Round six. I don't know what happened between here and round six. P10 has no recoil to start. I mean, it's not zero recoil now. They did increase it a little bit. It's just like every gun he's using has zero recoil. I assume if I restarted my game, the ambient sound bug would go away, but might as well just wait till. Oh, it's only a five round match. Okay, for once I saw a tiny bit of recoil there. That is the most recoil I've seen all game on him. there with the destruction like if I look up this player and he's not like a diamond level I think that was proof right there that he has a recoil cheat because it looks like the bullets are still hitting below where he's shooting which in case you weren't aware people with recoil cheats it'll look like they have zero control of the recoil like it'll go from here to there really easily but the bullets will still go in the middle and you can kind of tell the bullets are still lower but I, I doubt he would just suddenly have shitty aim like that jake harper dot jake harper i was wondering why that name sounded familiar i forgot that's two and a half men level 53 and he has a 1.65 kd um, played with two random people.
This very much reads like he bought a account that was abandoned and then either started cheating on it or just started smurfing hard on it. Um, based off of the what looked like very little recoil, granted, like I mentioned before, it was incredibly hard to tell since it was super choppy and laggy. But given how little recoil he had, it's I'm leaning more towards cheating. But not that high of a KD. But just seemed like always knew where people were and was just pre-firing and headshotting people. I don't know. I would lean more towards cheating, even though it could have been like a bug from, I don't know, any number of things, especially with match re replay, but I'm going to lean towards cheating. We have Melon Sicko Mode, who's accusing POW140, who says that probably is a streamer mode name, which I would believe. And then, um, Melon Sicko Mode accusing POW140. Oh, it's their own teammate. Uh oh. Uh, are you gonna be obvious? Doesn't look like crazy obvious there. You could actually play it off of sound, depending on how good you are. That seems a little bit more suspicious. Looks like they're waiting for them to peek. Expecting that cap can there, which seems like less cheating. I don't even know what they shot there or how they shot there. What is this hip fire that he has? It almost feels like they're in a cowboy movie and they're just like. <laughs> and they suck with a pistol. They're also blind. Next round, let's see. Is this maybe that super tight shotgun spread? Uh, doesn't look that tight there, but I think it must be something to do with shotguns, because... Wait, they just one-shot the barricade? I don't think we need to really watch anything more to know that you cannot in any way shotgun that door from that far away and break it with one pump. There is no way you can do that. And they're very obviously now tracking these people. Oh! They got big destruction. I'm pretty sure the document says that they think that he toggled in the last round. My man was toggled from the beginning. I was wondering if it was going to grenade himself. Hmm. Well, he's cheating. So, POW 140. Melon Sicko mode, let's see. If it is a stern mode name, I'm going to have to start using other people. He is an R6 track, tracker user. Uh, that was the 14th. He did not have it open that day, unfortunate. To save you guys the three minutes of me looking at every single person in the match and seeing if they had it open, no. Not a single person had R6 tracker, so I could not find what the actual name of the cheater was. Oh, okay, not a single person had R6 tracker open 
during that match, which means we cannot find out what their real username is. But either way, Pal was cheating. We know that for sure. Which means that today we had three cheaters, right? Number 28, YNCJ. Uh, Jake Harper was also cheating, right? And then this one. So I guess four. And then 06.mo was not cheating. But not a great day for, for Siege. Even worse day for Ash Yagermains. If you are an Ash Yagermain, you are a cheater.